guys, it's Hannah and I'm here today with a little more of a casual video. <laughs> so I'm here today that I wanted to do something a little bit different and I was talking with one of my friends and I was like, I need some filming ideas and he was like, why don't you film the top five things that you want more of in reading and books. I was like, that is a brilliant idea. So I'm going to sit down and go through my top five list, and I have Sherlock here with me as well. He has just been a little cuddle bug today, so he wants to be in the video with me. So here he is. So the number one, easily what I want more of that I crave, I look, go to bookstores, I ask about, I want more of this is magical realism. Now, I can take magical realism any type of way, but magical realism in YA, there just isn't. And I want magical realism as a genre to be bigger. I love it. I think that it is so neat to read about a book and put yourself in that world that it's got magical elements that could you can relate to. You can, like, if someone made a screwdriver, it'd be magical. You'd be like, I have a screwdriver. That could totally happen. And it, like puts you in that mindset and it's just nice to have. Bye kitty. It's just nice to have that relatability with your books and I absolutely love magical realism and I want more of it in my life. Number two that I want in my life more in books is girls who are the like bad guy like I'm not talking about catty girls we have enough books about catty girls being like the mean girl to the like nice girl I want a guy main character who is chasing after the bad girl you never see bad girl as a character and then uh, without it being sexualized and she turns into the slut I want to see someone be the bad girl like there is like Edward was the bad boy in Twilight because he was like the unattainable guy that's not and I feel like the only way to do that and for girls is to make her snobby and make her stuck up I don't want any of that I want it to be straight across I want the girl to be the bad girl and the guy chasing after her that I want to see more of that number three I want to see more girl bosses I want to see girls in power and control without them again taking the caddy route and dealing with all that backlash. I want to see girl power being respected and like brought up as something to achieve and have a character to look up to. Most of the time when you see like Devil Wears Prada for example, now I've not read the book, don't kill me, I've only watched the movie. but. In that, in that movie, the editor of Vogue is this super powerful, hardcore woman who has to be strong and tough on the outside so she can survive the industry. I don't want that. I want them to be, like, prized for their hard work that they've gone up to. And they kind of touch on that with Devil Wears Prada, but then it's like, they also touch on that she is a total bitch, and I don't want that. I want it to be like a... I want to be like her type of thing and I like I want a character connect to to strive after her dreams and not be like torn down about it. Number four, I want more like funny comedy in our books. Um, even with contemporary there's not a lot of funny characters. There's, I know, especially in fantasy, I want a funny character in fantasy. The only, like, hilarity that I found in books would be maybe the Percy Jackson. There is Fred and George and Harry Potter as well, but I want, like, some gut-wrenching books. That is my favorite when a book makes me have a an audible reaction or, like, a physical reaction while I'm reading the book, and I want more of that. I want it to get, get so deep underneath my skin that I can't help myself while I'm reading it to have that emotion and be seen in my face, especially myself, because... I don't, like, I let things sink in, but I don't ever, like, react to things. Even when I'm, like, reading stuff, like, you know how, like, LOL, like, who actually LOLs? If you do, go for you, because I sure don't. I know I don't. Like, I laugh in my head, but I don't ever laugh out loud unless it's something really funny. 
I want books that are really funny. And number five, I'm gonna kind of count this as role reversal. I just want to see girls and guys normal work positions and guys in normal girl work positions, whatever, you know, like the stereotypical work jobs. I want to see a girl thrive in a man's department and a guy thriving in a women's department and just shaking things up a bit and that totally can follow the, the norms of fighting against the other genders and having to prove themselves but doing it and being successful. I want to see more of that and I want to see like non-popular jobs. So for example like a girl in a gamer world or a guy in a fashion industry and I want to see that type of stuff mix and see and make it possible for people to read it and be like yeah if I this is my passion I can totally do that. And I just want to have that inspiration out there for people when they're reading to connect to it and kind of break the mold and break the barrier and make it possible for people and I want that idea to be out in the world. So that is my five top things I am missing in my books that I want more of. If you guys want to do this I would love for you to do it and then like leave links down below. I would love to watch them. What are you missing from your books? What do you want to see? I would love some great discussions down below about any of the topic or any of the topics that I have chosen in this video and I will talk to you guys down there. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.